and welcome back to the Derby County Save. This is episode 5, I believe. Well, I did record an episode previously, show you all the transfers that was done after January, but the audio kind of messed up on me, so I've had to record it again. And as you can see, we did play the Newcastle and Burton games. We lost 3 2 against Newcastle, and we drew 0 0 against Burton Albion, which was a terrible result. So, Obviously, you haven't seen the transfers, so I will go over them again for you. So, with regards as the ins, we brought in Todd Kane on loan from Chelsea, and Wesley Saeed from Stad Rennes, and Darren Boyd from St Mirren. Two loanies were just cover players, and this Darren Boyd is a youngster that I think is going to be absolutely fantastic in the future. High determination, high work rate. He's got pretty decent physicals. We only brought him in for £700,000. So I think he's going to be a star of the future. And if not, investment, we can sell him on for a bit of money later down in the line. Now, with regards to the outs, we did sell a couple of key players. Cyrus Christie went to Watford. As soon as they bid for him, he started moaning. He came unhappy because he wanted to leave for a bigger club. Personally, I don't think Watford are a big club in Derby, but he did leave for 3.1 million. And then Johnny Russell left. He doesn't fit in our team, doesn't fit in our formation. And we let him go for 1.7. So, what do you guys think of the overall transfer business? If you want to leave your feedback in the comments, that'd be absolutely fantastic. Let me know what you would have done, what you wouldn't have done. If you would have signed these players, I'll get, let you have a look at Todd Kane. These are his stats. High determination, high work rate, pretty attacking across the board. And this is Wesley Saeed. Again, I think he's pretty decent, but let me know what you guys think. Now, with regards to the form, previous to these two games, uh, we lost 2-1 against Norwich, 1-0 against Liverpool. We played really, really well against Liverpool. Can't fault the boys for that. They only got a lucky goal in the 18th minute, otherwise that would have gone to extra time or even a replay. 2-2 uh, against Leeds, David Nugent and Wesley Saeed with the goals. Daniel Johnson's asset again with the scoring goals, 2-1 against Reading, that was a good result. And the best result of all is 5-1 against Ipswich. So that's our form. If you look at the league table, we have dropped as well. We are now two points off the leaders but Newcastle do have a game in hand over us so hopefully we can claw that back with a good run of form so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get to the game and go from there and we're back at the game against Bristol City as you can see by the screen here we have gone for a slightly different formation this has helped us out in the past when teams have started to guess our formation and started to slide up against this so I've gone for Two home games that we got against Bristol and Bristol and Cardiff. They are both home games. I'm going to use this formation in hopes to outfox the opponents and get some points on the board. See if we can get back to the top. So as you can see by the team, what we've gone with is Scott Carson and goal, Todd Kane, Richard Keogh, Jason Shackle, Anya, Daniel Johnson in that advanced playmaker role. Scourwood in the ball with a midfielder and Will Hughes with a deep line playmaker. Then we've gone with Nugent, Bent and Blackman up front. So hopefully we can get some goals and get back into some form. Get into the game and see where we go. And while the game's loaded up, I just want to say thank you very much for all the views that I'm getting on the videos, all the likes. And I'm just getting a lot of interaction from Twitter and from YouTube, everything's going all right. If you want to see anything that's anything at all with this save, just let me know. I'll do it for you. If so, if you got any feedback, if you want to see any players, who do you think I should sign? Doubt anyone, anything like that. Any tactical advice? Let me know, and I will try and implement it as much as possible. This is as much your save as it is mine, and I am really enjoying making these videos, and I'm just overwhelmed by the amount of views that I am getting on these videos. So let's get into the game and see what we can do against Bristol. And take the team to money. Boys fired up. Anyone that's interested, these are the instructions for this tactic. 
Like I say, it's worked for us in the past, so let's see if he can win. Get the pleasantries. Let's go. Pick up highlight. I'm not going to commentate it. People need to remind me not to do that in the comment section. Please. I'm still commentating. This is just right. Blackman with a shot. Unlucky Blackman. Come on. See what we can do. Down with the corner. Sends it to the near post. Johnson gets it. Back out to Scowen. Whip a ball in. Keep it. Collects it. Comfortably. Come on, Darwin. We need some points. We need some points on the board. Come on. Magnuson with the corner. But Carson drops the ball in the area. A bit of panic there. A bit of panic from the Derby defence. Come on, we need to do something else. Come on. Yeah, we'll just wait for a highlight game. Come on. Kane. Gowan. Johnson. Hughes. And lovely pass. Anya. Runs past the defence. Back to Hughes. Gowan. Is off to the winger. Nugent. Oh. Nugent scores. Yes. I don't know what happened. And particularly, I don't care. As long as it went in the back of the net. Yes, please. What happened, Nugent? He drops it. Nugent retreats and gets the ball in the back of the net. Thank you very much. 1-0 Derby County. In with the corner. Oh, no. That was a cheap goal to give away. That was a cheap goal to give away. Lancaster with the corner. Goes into the back of the net. Cheap goal. Carson. Goal kick. Punts it out. He's collects it. To the star man Johnson. Kane on the wing. Crosses it in. Easy, easy to deal with on the again. Didn't clear it properly. Recycle possession. Kane. Darren Bent, the man, the myth, the legend that is Darren Bent, smashes it home. That moves us up to second position. Thank God for that. We're moving back up. Level one points with the leaders. Time. About time we get some good form. Come on. Hughes, Kane, I'm just going to, have to close the blinds for a second because the sun, Nugent with the goal, the sun's decided to come out, just bear with me two seconds, like that, Nugent with the goal, come on, what else can we do here, come on, very pleased with that performance, 3-1 at half time, very pleased, let's keep going, keep Keep the pressure on them. The new formation seems to be working all right. David Newside. Oh, uh, having more shots and we've got more possession. Our pass completion is eighty-three percent, which is do the game out. Do a little team talk here just to calm the boys down. Nugent, left no Hughes, Scowen, Daniel Johnson. Hughes back to Anya Blackman. Oh, <laughs> Nick Blackman with the screaming volley. 4 1. Anya on the wing crosses it in. Nick Blackman with the screaming volley. Thank you very much. Need to close the game out now. Just need to close the game out so we get this win. Pause it and make a couple of substitutions. And John's just looking for Bryson on. I had a comment on Twitter that Will Hughes, even though he looks tired, he does survive the whole game. I'm going to leave him on, see what, see what, see what he can do. I'm going to bring on Julian to start after his injury, give him a bit more game time. Baloney. Let's play the game. See if we can close it out. We'll go back on to control. Control the game a bit more. 
close this game out, looks like it. Looks like we can close this game out and get the win. We can get the win and actually finally get back on form. Right, Newcastle dropped some points as well, which is fantastic. By that means we are second and we're back in contention for the championship. Well done. See how Newcastle did. Newcastle playing, I think. Newcastle lost 2 0 against Wolves. Wolves did us a favour there. Norwich do. Norwich drew 0 0. That was an absolutely fantastic weekend for us. It's back level on points with Norwich. Uh, again, a point ahead of Newcastle. So, I will be back for the game against Blackburn. Cardiff, sorry, who are 21st in the league. Hopefully, we can get another win. And we are back for the game against Cardiff. And as you can see, we have got a suspension to Josh Scowen. Got the yellow card in the last. To bring on. To bring on Bradley Johnson and that bit ball, ball winning midfielder. Vidra. Vidra's back from injury. He's not fully fit, but we are going to use him in this game because we do need to get him back in. And we're going to go pretty much with the same team as before. Hopefully we can get another W. Team, and let's go. Obviously fa heavily favourite for the game. Newcastle are playing Everton. Uh, New what am I talking about? Newcastle are playing Norwich today. So that's first versus third. Hopefully they get a draw and we can capitalise on that and actually jump ahead of them and get back into top spot. That's the plan anyways. We'll bring up the latest source so we can keep an eye on that. Uh, hopefully that's what we do. Manage players to finish off where they're left. Come on. Um. Let's see if what we can do here. Newcastle already 1 0 up. Here's Perez with a the goal. There you go and take stop, top spot for the moment. Change that. Green with a free kick. Johnson to Bradley Johnson. Nick Blackman on the ball. David Nugent's on the run. He's all alone. No defenders. He's going to slot it past the keeper. No, he sends it wide. Unlucky. All on his own. Couldn't do anything with it. Shocking. That was the only highlight of the first half. Pretty boring, to be honest. Yeah, that wasn't good enough. So goes after the performance so far. And you look off. You can do about that. Everyone else looks fired up and ready to go. Still one nil at Norwich. So let's see if we can get a goal in the second half. Shackle with the header away to Hughes. Nugent. Bent. Bradley Johnson. Hughes is this another throwaway highlight, or is it actually going to come something from it? Oh, bad tackle, Keo. Bad tackle there. much happening we are controlling the game we have a corner Johnson with the corner Paul oh, Hughes don't care how it went in as long as it went in Richard Keogh with the goal people have been telling me to get rid of Richard Keogh because not many people like him They're doing alright for me at the moment so I'll take it and that brings us back into top position which is absolutely fantastic also with the goal kick to Cardiff, remember? Keo to Hughes to Johnson. Let's get it over the top. Hughes. Nice back heel. This is the ball. Back. No, we don't. Lambert's all on his own. No, our defenders are caught off guard there, and Lambert smashes it home. Norwich have equalised. But it's 1 1 at Carrow Road. 1 1 here at Pride Park. Over the top rope. Our defenders are all over the place. 
Lambert smashes it in the back post. So come on, we need to do something. See if we can introduce Vidra, see what he can do. Baron Bent is looking tired. Bring Vidra on in that centre role. I know his morale's poor. I know he's not very matched up. We do need some. I'm going to bring on as well Craig Bryson. Hughes. Look as well. I'm already attacking. Need to do something. Blackman with a free kick. Johnson. Bryson. Kane on the wing. Crosses it in. Nugent. Nugent shoots and Nugent scores. Gets in. Come on. 2-1. That sends us back top. Two points clear of Norwich. That this loan signing from Chelsea is making a bit of an impact. Nugent. Under the bar. Goalkeeper couldn't do anything about it. Thank you very much. Missing with the throw. Austin collects easily. Points it out. Bryson gets it. Batman. And Nugent all alone. Couldn't get the cross away. And you back to Bryson. You're going to have a strike. He is, but he sends it wide. Couldn't, ref we couldn't find the form that he had in earlier in. Throwing again. Nugent, Nugent, oh, unlucky, unlucky, up the corner though, crosses it in, Hedra, do anything there, again we are dominating the game, 16 shots, 10 off target, 4 on target, 1 clear cut chance, so I believe we should be, have more goals, but that looks like it's going to be the end of the game, Angle with the ball, McGregor. Gives it to Lambert, who does cause a threat. Again, it's back to Johnson. Kane. Vidra. Send it back out to Kane. Very clear. So that's the end of the game. That has got to be the end of the game. Thank you very much. Back. No! Oh, not back on top. Norwich got a second. Oh, no way. Thought we were top of the table, but Norwich got the second goal. Good win. We are sitting in second position, leveling points with Norwich. A goal difference. Alright, guys. Let me know when you want me to come back. Ideally, I will come back around this time, Fulham, Birmingham, Brentford. Then I'll do the last game of the season. And the playoffs, if we get there. Or... I'll do the transfer special if you get into the Premier League. All right, guys. Pledge race. Leave a like if you like the content. Subscribe if you want to stay around. And any comment that you do put, I will reply to. All right, guys. Do that.